Look what an interesting thing. You must have learned that what keeps you stuck to the ground is because of something called the force of gravity. Planet Earth, because it has a very large mass, is attracting you to its center. This is the concept of gravity proposed by Isaac Newton. He described gravity as an instantaneous force between masses, like an apple falling to the ground. However, in 1915, Albert Einstein revolutionized the world when he proposed that gravity was not a force where objects attracted each other, but rather that it was a curvature in space-time. Einstein united space and time into a single thing, imagining that space was a mesh. He proposed that an object with mass like the sun would distort this mesh. Therefore, an object with less mass like planet Earth should follow its trajectory following this curvature in space-time. The change predicted by Einstein in the theory of general relativity was not well received at first because it directly challenged Isaac Newton's view of gravity, a genius revered for centuries. However, in 1919, a solar eclipse that occurred in Brazil, in the city of Sobral in Sierra, once and for all proved Einstein's theory that gravity was actually the curvature of space-time. Thanks to a total solar eclipse, astronomers were able to observe and photograph stars that were close to the sun during daylight. If Einstein was right, the light from these stars should be deflected because of the curvature that the sun's mass causes in space-time, making them appear to be in different positions than they actually were. Finally, Albert Einstein was right and forever revolutionized our understanding of the universe. Before gravity pulls you to the next video, let it pull your finger toward the subscribe button. Don't fight the force. Just surrender to curiosity and join the cosmic frontier. Because here your mind expands faster than the universe itself.